Let's get tips and reviews. Today we're looking at how you can upgrade your MacBook Air or your iPod video hard drive using the Mach Extreme technology. Now Mach Extreme is a new company from Taiwan that just started earlier in January of this year. They specialize in SSD drives, flash memory drives, memory and uh, essentially I'm going to start off by reviewing one of their products, an SSD drive. It's an actual tiny little ZIF drive, 1.8 inch drive. It ranges from 60 gigabytes to 240 gigabytes and it's used mostly to upgrade existing components that use these nano ZIF drives, these small slim SSD drives. Now what's good about this is for example I've got an iPod video fifth generation that is 30 gigs and the hard drive broke so now I needed to upgrade it and replace it so I got this one here this hard drive is basically a 60 gig SSD drive okay it's 64 megs of cache it's super fast to 120 megs read and 65 megs write per second is more than enough for an iPod video so imagine if you put this in your older MacBook Air that uses these same type of drives and again you can upgrade it from a 60 gig to a 240 uh, gig drive depending on which uh, SSD drive you want. Here are the specs of the drive that I'm going to be installing in my iPod video that was broken and essentially I'm going to bring it back to life. Now opening up here the um, the MX Nano ZIF you can see here it's hand tested so they ensure quality control so that's great. Um, it gives you a little starter there on ensuring that you install it properly using pin 1 and uh, the orientation of the socket of course when you plug it in. Let's uh, take a closer look here at it. Take it out of the box and um, you can see that the drive is very small, right? Very slim, small and it's meant for very specific um, MacBook Airs and the iPod video uh, fifth generation that I mentioned. You can see the connection there, okay? So uh, if you were to open up your older iPod video today, you would probably find the same type of drive in size. And that's what I did. I had an old iPod video. I opened it very carefully using the sides, right, not to, um, to scratch and break it, and popped it open very gently without um, ripping out the, uh, the connections there. Took out the existing drive, which was a Toshiba, actually, and uh, that Toshiba 30 um, uh, gig drive that was in there no longer worked and um, basically remembering how the connections are which aren't too many and replacing uh, the foam padding I took off the foam padding that was on there looked at the connection the way it was connected and um, matched it up with the new SSD drive which has the exact same connection okay so it's not rocket science you just have to be very careful pay attention when you open it up make sure that things are aligned and um, and it was very simple to replace so I put the foam and uh, the plastic that was on the other drive on the new one on the uh, MX technology the mock technology SSD drive here the uh, nano ZIF plugged it in properly right there attached the case back on turned it on plugged it into my uh, my Mac that I had and um, made sure that it detected it and that's basically what it did so as long as you plug in things properly the um, the Mac that I had here detected that uh, I had a new iPod basically did not know the capacity yet it had to restore it basically and reformat it and put everything back on and I went ahead and said yep go ahead and restore it install the latest version of the uh, software for the iPod video went through all the uh, screens the prompts here and uh, let it do its thing right let it restore and go through the motions of um, basically reinitializing the iPod video putting everything back on from scratch so these are the screens basically that I went through so that you know uh, more or less it took me about I would say about 15 minutes to do the whole process so taking it apart and installing the hard drive was probably the most delicate part of the whole thing after that once you plug it in following the screens turning it on that's a piece of cake just follow the prompts and um, 
and that's it and then you've got your brand new um, iPod video back to life with basically 60 gigs of space so this is just absolutely awesome brand new ready to go super fast and I definitely recommend it so I'd like to thank uh, MX technology for providing it and I hope you enjoyed this uh, video and thank you for watching